What's up guys? Uh, Apple has released today iOS 17.3 beta 2 and along with that it also released macOS 14.3 beta 2, watchOS 10.3 beta 2 and tvOS 17.3 beta 2. Now let's talk uh, what's new in this update. And we start with the first thing, uh, this is a face ID stolen device protection. So if you, if you go to face ID and passcode and here you'll see something new which you didn't have in a, in a previous update. It says here, I hope you can see it uh, here stolen device protection which is on right now so this is a new feature let's say if your phone is stolen and whoever stole your phone he he has the password as well so before this update you were able to you know turn off the iCloud and you can use the phone you know with your own uh, iCloud ID now this adds another layer of protection, you know, that's why it's called stolen device protection. And another good feature in this, if if I wanna turn this protection off, first of all, it will validate with uh, my, my face ID. Okay, and after that, it shows this message, security delay required to change stolen device. So a security delay is required because the stolen device protection is active and the iPhone is not at, at a familiar location. So let's say if your device is stolen and it's at a new location, the security delay will last for one hour. So it will take one hour before you can turn this feature off. So it's another protection, you know, it's not only with this um, face ID, let's say I want to change passcode. Okay. and on the passcode it will show me the same message again like one hour delay i cannot change the passcode right away so that's another you know good feature it has added apple has added in 17.3 beta 2 and uh, i thought it's a it's a really good thing and i just ran the geekbench 6 in the single core score and multi-core multi -core score. I'm using XS Max and it's 3052, which is not bad because the average score for this model running 17.3 beta 2 is 2556. So I think it's not bad. So the next thing is in Apple Music. Uh, second thing in the 17.3 beta 2 brings collaborative Apple Music playlist Friends that you have invited to collaborate on a playlist can use emojis reactions to display their opinion. However, the playlist owner has complete control over who has the power to add or remove songs from the playlist. So I don't have any playlist created here to show or demonstrate, but you know, it's a collaborative Apple Music playlist that they have, you can, uh, you know, we invite some friends you know to collaborate on the same playlist so they can they can show you emojis and to you know just to to read the song they're listening so i'm not into music that much so i cannot go in detail and and some phones uh, i've heard the complaints that you know this brightness issues after this update uh, in some models actually you know it, it, it's it's uh, glitching the brightness so I don't know on this model I don't I do not have any problem on access max and also the along with these uh, couple of you know cool features there are just few bugs fixes here and there and also when the first time I I, I went to check these, you know, the iPhone storage. It did not load right away. It took a little longer, but you know, second time it, it, it didn't take that long. 
So I don't think it's a problem, but it also depends on different models, which model you're using. If you're facing any problem, please let me know in the comment. And that's it for today. I'll see you in the next video.